Biren Singh government is not the solution. Biren Singh government is the problem. So you can't keep the problem and then say the problem will be solved. It's no longer a constitutional government. Therefore, this government must go. Every section has lost confidence in Mr. Biren Singh. He was silent for seven days after May 3. And he says that he came to know about the May 4th incident only when the video became viral. He is the Home Minister. What is his police doing? What is his intelligence doing? Therefore, this government must go. Article 355 must be applied. If there is a case for applying Article 355, this is the case. The central government must protect every state from internal disturbance or external aggression. This is the case to take action under 355 and then consequently remove the government and impose president's rule. The only, the only, only president's rule may, certainly Biren Singh government will not, a president's rule may give an option for some seasoned administrators to go there and try to bring the situation under control. It all shows that the government in Manipur is broken down. It's no longer a constitutional government. Therefore, this government must go. That's our position. Otherwise, nobody will find that the situation is conducive to come to the table. See, I'm not blaming the Methis, I'm not blaming the Cookies, I'm not blaming the Nagas. Every side has suffered. Every side has suffered loss of precious lives. The only way we can bring them to the table is to have a neutral administration, seasoned administrators who will work their way slowly and carefully and try to bring them to the table after a period of time. But the immediate situation is to take control of the law and order. The law and order is not there. There is mutual suspicion, mutual bickering. So Biren Singh government is not the solution. Biren Singh government is the problem. The problem is Mr. Biren Singh's government. So you can't keep the problem and then say the problem will be solved.